This is the cheapest 5G device I have seen and it is from ITEL. And this is the ITEL P55 5G. It is powered by the MediaTek Dimensity 6080 chipset which is a 6 nanometer processor. And coming at about 138,000 Naira, this is remarkable as 5G is usually reserved for more expensive phones. But this is just one member of the P55 series ITEL just launched. The ITEL P55 series covers all budget categories from the most expensive ITEL P55 5G officially priced at 138,200 Naira to the least expensive ITEL P55 officially priced by ITEL at 93,900 Naira. The other two models are the ITEL P55T and the ITEL P55 Plus which are priced at 101,900 Naira and 115,900 Naira respectively. All four models have some common features such as a 6.6 inch display, a 5000 mAh battery, a 50 megapixel direct camera and an 8 megapixel selfie camera. But the question is how do they differ from each other because of course there are some differences even though they are not very obvious but there are still some differences another question would be which one is best for you and that is exactly what we are going to find out in this detailed review and i apologize in advance because this is going to be a slightly longer video than normal because we will compare all four models in terms of unboxing design features and build quality display performance and memory software camera and of course their value for money what's up guys it's victor here again if this is not your first time here you are absolutely welcome but if this is your first time here kindly subscribe and activate the notification bell so that you are notified the next time i post a new video like this one it is an exciting time for itel and that is because itel just had a brand makeover recently and changed its brand identity or logo to a new one which looks more modern and sleek at least in my opinion i like the new logo as it reflects the brand's vision of making technology more inclusive and innovative and this is reflected in their bold step into 5g technology however on all four models of the itel p55 series the new logo is missing maybe they already produced these smartphones before the new brand makeover maybe not anyway each model in the p55 series comes with the standard items in a typical ITEL red and white box, the device is a injector pin, transparent plastic or TPU protective case, earphones, a USB Type-C cable, a 45 watt charger brick for the P55 Plus and 18 watt charger for the rest. I guess the P55 Plus must be truly special but let's keep an eye on that one and find out later in this video. The unboxing experience is pretty standard for a budget phone but I appreciate that ITEL included the case and earphones which are not always given nowadays. The only difference between the four models in terms of unboxing is the charging brick. Only the P55 Plus came with a 45 watt charger brick in the box, the rest came with 18 watt charger bricks. The ITEL P55 series has a similar design across all four models and of course with some minor differences here and there. The phones have a plastic body with a textured finish on the back giving a premium feel, a good grip and preventing fingerprints and smudges. P55 5G's design is slightly marred by its water drop notch and larger bottom bezels, a somewhat outdated look. The P55 Plus, P55T and P55 with their punch hole notches and the P55T's unique ring LED light on the back stand out more. However, the P55, while similar in design to the P55T, doesn't quite match the premium feel of the others. The back also has a large camera module with two sensors and an LED flashlight as well as some ITEL power branding designed by ITEL. Well, this can be argued because the P55T and P55 look so much like the iPhone from the back. That is not a bad thing because I know a lot of people will love this design just because of this camera placement. But for me, I prefer the slightly unique back design of the P55 5G and P55 Plus. The phones have a power button and a volume rocker on the right side, a SIM tray on the left side, a 3.5mm headphone jack, a USB Type-C port, a microphone and speaker grill on the bottom and there is nothing on the top. The power button also doubles as a fingerprint sensor which is fast and accurate. The phones also support face unlock which is convenient but not very secure. The build quality of the ITEL P55 series is decent. The phones feel solid and sturdy. Even though there is a screen protector pre-applied, you may want to use the case and tempered glass to avoid scratches and cracks. Overall, I prefer the design of the 
P55 Plus because of that unique camera module and the punch hole notch instead of the water drop notch on the P55 5G. Let's talk about their displays. Each phone features a 6.6 inch display with a 720 by 1612 resolution and a 90 hz refresh rate. The display quality is decent, the colors are bright and vivid. The main difference between the four models in terms of display is the notch. The iTel P55, iTel P55T and iTel P55 Plus all have a standard dot notch which is small and unobtrusive. The iTel P55 5G has a V-shaped water drop notch which is slightly bigger and more noticeable. The notch does not affect the display quality or the user experience but it may affect your aesthetic preference. The display of the iTel P55 series is good enough for basic tasks such as browsing, texting or watching videos. The display is not very immersive as it has a noticeable chain which is very much expected at this price range. For performance and memory capacity, the iTel P55 series has different chipsets and memory configurations across the four models which in fact affects their performance and speed but one thing they all have in common is the 128 GB internal storage capacity. The P55 5G 6 nanometers MediaTek Dimensity 6080 processor outperforms the 8 core 12 nanometer Unisoc TC0C found in the other models. The P55 5G is remarkably snappy which is a pleasant surprise in this price range. The P55 Plus and P55T offer good performance but the P55 while competent isn't as efficient as the other models. Oh god, P55, P55, P55. Since they all have the same storage memory space of 128GB, let's focus on the RAM and processor configuration to help us choose the best in terms of speed and memory capacity. The iTel P55, which is the most affordable model in the series, has 4GB of RAM, which can be expanded to 12GB with the virtual RAM feature iTel called MemFusion. This feature allows the phone to use some of the internal storage as extra RAM, which can improve the multitasking performance of the phone. The iTel P55T is a slightly upgraded version of the iTel P55 with the same processor and storage with 4 gigs of RAM. The iTel P55T also runs on Android 14 Go with iTel OS 13.6 which is a lightweight and optimized version of Android that can run faster and smoother on low-end devices like these ones. And that technically means that the performance on the iTel P55T will be better compared to the other models because it has an OS tailored to its capacity and performance. The iTel P55 Plus is another upgrade from the iTel P55T and P55 with the same processor and storage but with 8 gigs of RAM and 8 gigs of virtual RAM, making it a total of 16 gigs of RAM. This is the highest amount of RAM in the series and it can provide a very smooth and responsive user experience. The iTel P55 5G. This is the most advanced and expensive model in the series with its MediaTek Dimensity 6080 processor which is an octa-core chipset manufactured using a 6 nanometer process technology. As such, it can deliver high performance and low power consumption, making it ideal for gaming and multitasking. The P55 5G also has 6 gigs of RAM and 6 gigs of virtual RAM, making a total of 12 GB of RAM. This is enough to run most apps and games smoothly and supports the 5G network. So for speed and performance, it's a no-brainer. The P55 5G obviously shines brightest. In the battery category, you will find some key differences. Let's start with the P55 5G. The P55 5G has a 5000mAh battery that can last up to 2 days on a single charge and an 18 w charger that can fill it up in less than 3 hours. The P55 Plus has the fastest charging speed. It has a 5000mAh battery that can last up to 2 days on a single charge and a 45 w charger that can fill it up in less than 2 hours. Then we have the P55T which is the model for the power users. It has a massive 6000 mAh battery that can last up to 3 days on a single charge and an 18 w charger brick that can fill it up in less than 4 hours. And finally, the basic model in the series, iTel P55 and it still packs a punch. It has a 5000 mAh battery that can last up to 2 days on a single charge and an 18 w charger that can fill it up in less than 3 hours. The iTel P55 series runs on Android 13 with iTel's own custom skin called iTel OS version 13 except for the iTel P55T which rocks the latest Android version 14. The software experience is bloated with a lot of features and customizations, quite a lot of useful features. The device is running on Android 13 with iTel OS 13.0 
Zero are equipped with features like peak proof, social turbo, game mode and more. The P55T with its Android 14 Go and ITEL OS 13.6 misses out on several standard features found on other models. So the only difference in the software department across all the four models in the ITEL P55 series is that the P55T runs on the latest version of Android Android 14. This could have easily made the P55T the best in terms of software but it's the light version of Android 14 and that explains the lack of standard features and the Ivana AI assistant found on other models. The camera setup is basically the same across the board. The ITEL P55 series has a 50 megapixel dry rear camera setup with a main sensor and a depth sensor and an 8 megapixel selfie camera. However, the camera experience and quality are not the same across the board. The P55 5G has a more robust camera application and features. It has a handful of unique features like dual video for recording videos with your back and front camera at once and sky shop which can change and enhance the sky in your pictures a super night mode for night photography a pro camera mode for dialing camera settings to your liking and a film mode that has some stylish and cinematic video templates the p55 5g can also shoot videos on the back and front as high as 2k and 30 frames per second settings and produces slightly better images than the rest the other devices can only go as high as 1080p and 30 frames per second when recording videos. There is no form of stabilization but the P55 5G feels and appears a little bit more stable than the rest. Generally, the camera quality of the ITEL P55 series is decent but not very impressive. The camera is also not very versatile as it lacks any kind of wide angle, macro or telephoto lens which would have expanded the shooting options and scenarios. But for the price and because this phone is practically or basically made for power users for long battery life, I think the quality is satisfactory. The ITEL P55 series offers great value for money as it provides some features and specifications that are rare or unheard of in this price range. The most notable feature is the 5G connectivity which is only available in the ITEL P55 5G model but it is still a remarkable achievement as it is the cheapest 5G phone in the market. The other features that make the ITEL P55 series worth buying are the large 6.6 inch display with a 90Hz refresh rate, the massive 5000mAh battery or 6000mAh battery on the P55T and the relatively fast charging capability. The ITEL P55 series also has some drawbacks such as the 720p display and the average camera performance. However, these drawbacks are not deal breakers as they are expected or acceptable in this price range. I like that the ITEL P55 series has 4 models with different prices and specifications which can suit different needs and preferences and budgets. The ITEL P55 is the cheapest model priced at 93,900 Naira. The ITEL P55T is slightly more expensive priced at 101,900 Naira but it is also slightly better with Android 14 and a big 6000 mAh battery. The ITEL P55 Plus is even more expensive priced at 115,900 Naira but it is also even better with a higher memory and a faster 45 watts charger. The ITEL P55 5G, the Oga Pata Pata of them all. This is the most expensive model priced at 138,200 Naira, but it is also the fastest model with a MediaTek Dimensity 6080 processor and 5G support. The ITEL P55 series is a great choice for anyone who is looking for a budget friendly smartphone with some impressive features and specifications especially 5G connectivity. Now, considering the features, design and pricing, the P55 Plus stands out to me as the best value for money. And that is because of its 45 watts fast charging and high RAM and also the design. The P55 5G, while impressive, may not be the best choice for a lot of Nigerians without 5G coverage. The P55T, while up to date in software, falls behind due to its light OS version and fewer features. All in all, ITEL's P55 series offers something for everyone, making tech advancements like 5G more accessible and setting a new standard in the budget smartphone market. Like and share this video if it was helpful and don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you are not. I don't know why you are not subscribed but don't forget to subscribe. Also check out the ITEL S23 Plus if you need a slightly more premium ITEL phone or check out this video I just uploaded. Thanks for watching guys and Happy New Year.